It's Tip Tuesday. Our new series, Tip Tuesday, brings you a quick tip. If you're in the real estate investing game or aspire to be, this is for you. I'm Jen. I'm a landlord, educator, advocate, and broker of One Focus Property Management. Now, today is a really easy one, but I see landlords and realtors doing this all the time. Your tip, stop leaving the property unlocked or with the keys hidden in a mailbox or under the mat or under a rock or on the door frame. This is really, really unsafe and a huge exposure for you. If you think that your little trick is a secret, I'm here to tell you it's not. Scammers are checking these hiding places all the time. And I know what you're going to say. It is such a pain to carry the keys or go back and forth to the property to unlock it or lock it for the people who need to come and go. I have your solution. You can get lock boxes that are simple, like this one, for about $20. It just has a tumbler lock. You open the button and the keys are inside. Of course, it hangs on anything you can fit this shackle around. And of course, they have more expensive options. This one is a more sophisticated lock box. It allows you to have several different codes and you can control this electronically. This may not be what you need, but this, for $20, will certainly do the trick. So. I think you need to take the simple precaution and protect your property, but why should you care? Um, well, the property can really easily be damaged, and I often will hear landlords talking about break-ins at their property, but when I press and ask more questions, it turns out the property was vacant and unsecured, so I would hardly call that a break-in, although it is still traumatic and gives the landlord a loss. The bigger threat I would bring to your attention is that of a squatter or that of a scammer who gets access to your property and rents it to someone else falsely. They may have them fill out an application, pay a deposit, pay rent. They may even do a move-in inspection. But what you'll learn when you come to the property is you see it and there's people living in there and then you have a situation. Because when you have a squatter or especially somebody who believes they've leased the property rightly, you will have to evict them. A simple call to the police will not get these people out of your home. It is a lengthy, expensive, and arduous process to handle squatters. So we're all gonna promise today, no more leaving the doors unlocked or keys in a hiding place anymore. In case you didn't know, we post these videos to our YouTube channel, so don't forget to subscribe there so you don't miss a thing. Until next time, bye.